Hello everybody, it's my first time here at Goa Fest uh, and I know that it's happening after a very long time, in fact I think after a good couple of years and uh, just in my first time already it's been uh, the first day for me and uh, already it's all really it's lit up, uh, it's really excited, uh, we are really meeting a bunch of the ecosystem from the creative to the media to the tech side and uh, I think yeah, the fun, the enthusiasm and also the kind of conversations are extremely, extremely unique. So uh, looking forward to much more on day three and the closure uh, to Goa Fest. Thank you. Hi guys, my name is Tai Shafra and this is my first time at the Goa Fest. Uh, quite an interesting thing to do actually. Uh, I never expected it to be this vibrant and fun. Uh, I've just met a lot of people who I've never known and uh, I've come alone since so a it's a very interesting experience. Uh, you're alone but you don't feel alone. There are so many people from the fraternity. Uh, and really, really nice, helpful, lovely people. Uh, garmi bahut hai. It's really hot. Uh, minus the heat, it's just... Hi, I'm delighted to talk to you. Yes, Goa Fest is 15 years old and it's uh, wonderful. I dare say I have been coming here every year for 15 years. So if you ask me where do we go from here, well, we have come a long way but I think there's a lot more ground we need to cover. As I said this morning, I think we need to not be happy with 1600 people coming to Goa Fest, we need to have 16,000 people coming to Goa Fest. And for that, I think we need to tap the resources of our media friends. The advertising business is now a 90,000 crore business and media feeds off it. And I would think uh, if media could you know, come forward with uh, greater amounts of sponsorships, we could subsidize the delegate fee and make it a lot more affordable. And that is how we would get a large number of young people into this uh, three-day platform and inspire them and motivate them. Also, I think our effort now needs to be focused more on smaller towns and cities and we need to get the smaller agencies from those towns and cities to come to Goa Fest to at least once a year participate and see what the larger agencies and what the industry as a whole is up to. So that's the future of Goa Fest as I see it. Hi, thank you. Hi, it's, it's a pleasure to be at Goa Fest this year. After two years, we're actually all meeting in person. It's an incredible feeling. We've had a great turnaround. All agencies have supported us. So lots of sponsors this time. And a great turn up of, of people of all age groups. Some amazing sessions, great parties. Somehow we're all managing the heat and some fabulous entries that we've had. I think we've had a record number of entries. And all in all, I'm just so delighted that uh, we could actually make it. Sometimes I thought that COVID will again stop it, but luckily that did not happen. And I look forward to Goa Fest uh, 2023, which we shall do bigger, better, I'm sure. Thank you. Hi, my name is Shankar, uh, CEO of a company called Production Media Solutions. We are basically South storytellers. I've been coming to Goa Fest for a, for a very long time now. It's been more than about four or five years. And uh, it's good, but it could still be better. You know, every time uh, there's, uh, you know, I always carry a sense of disappointment with me. Uh, that, you know, there aren't, uh, there isn't much, uh, there was spoken about South, and uh, there, are, there isn't much emphasis which is laid on South. And, uh, you know, we are also a part of this country. And uh, we had serious accomplishments. You know, there are names, you know, I do wish to compare. You know, there's Air Rahman, there's Kamal Hassan, Mani Ratan, Ramoji Rao, and so on and so forth. And, uh, the entire Goa Fest is, uh, you know, uh, that there is this gargantuan list of uh, people only from the upper state of India. And I only wish and pray that I want to uh, give more and I wouldn't, I wouldn't say more importance to South, at least take baby steps towards South. Uh, 
बिगेस्ट काल की मेगलेक्टिव डांसिंग पर पुष्पा आधार के जी एफ सुपर स्टार रजनीकांत सन्नाथ है वॉट मूड यू वॉन्ट सुज यू आर डूइंग गुड बट यू नो प्लीज डोट इट नॉट थैंक यू So yeah, I mean, first things first. The fact that it's back is the best news. Uh, as far as participation is concerned, yeah, I mean, it could have been more, it could have been bigger, it could have been larger, more agencies. It would have been nice if more agencies had participated. But I mean, it's fabulous that after two miserable years and lockdowns and what not, work from home. And it's an opportunity for people who want to get out of home and to to come and meet industry peers, look at great work, get inspired. I mean, what is there not to like? I mean, it is fantastic that Profest is back, and let's hope it gets stronger from here on, here on here. So it's wonderful to be back in Goa Fest after two long years. It's a it's an old venue, old people. We are meeting after two years. It's wonderful, uh, but a lot of new things. We have a lineup of great speakers this year uh, for the conclave during the day, and we have a major change in the awards. Abbey is no longer just Abbey; it is Abbey One Show Award. and that really brings global practices global uh, award uh, jury uh, quality so we have really taken abi one show uh, to be one of the best awards now in the world and i think in years to come it will be the award to look out for so i think go office is that and it's uh, it's fantastic to meet people like you thank you very much okay so uh, we arrived some time back and i think uh, I was kind of surprised to see uh, this many people. There, these are definitely far fewer than what we uh, used to be before the uh, you know uh, pandemic uh, kind of broke. And we thought that uh, there would be far fewer people, but uh, I, I suppose some twelve to thirteen hundred people are registered, and, and that's a pretty decent number of delegates for uh, you know for this year. Uh, 